Hey there, take one second to hit and smash that like button and let's get started. Now, Bayesian models. Now, this is getting into a little more high level mathematics uh, statistics. And this gets into um, a distribution. So you can compute in here. Um, uh, let's see if I had it in here in the next layer. Yeah, the probability of one state giving another. So the probability that um, I'll come to work given that, you know, my kids were uh, helping me today to get to school. Whatever scenario you talk about, what's the probability of a scenario happening given a lot of different scenarios? And you see over here, broken down in three parts, but it's broken down into infinite level of classifications. So again, we'll go into it. There is a posterior, um, which, is, which is calculated. There is the uh, likelihood calculation, the class posterior probability, and a predictor. Um, typically, it's three parts, but you see four here, but typically three parts uh, broken down into the prior, the likelihood, and the posterior. And typically, the posterior is the end result. The likelihood is something that could happen in given different states. And the prior is something we do all the time. The prior is a state where we think about something we already kind of have a judgment on, but we need the exact likelihood to help um, make the difference. Any questions on that? Did, was that clear? No? Okay, perfect. <laughs> All right, so again, basic models and multinomial. Now, one of the great things about this is you are able to break it down, and this is Star Trek Next Generation. I have some uh, Trekky geeks in here, I know. Um, if you were to run a Bayesian model based on words that are said in a movie, against these different people at the bottom here, um, and you ran into a Bayesian model, you can see the heat map here showing what's the probability of certain words said versus for a particular person. So if I were to say, if I were to put a collection of these different words together into a model and then make the prediction, I can highly predict that, for example, Troy or, or Riker could say something based upon certain words in, together in a group. And that allows me to figure out if my solution is correct or not. All right, so good and bad of the Bayesian model is not as fast or not as wonderful as a neural network because neural network is more accurate. But what I like about the, um, the Bayesian model is there is a little bit of variance of error, similar to how we think, because it introduces some uh, curiosity uh, into the model. And that's why Bayesian is one of the ones I like. 